It's over, finish it. Hey YouTube, it's your boy Rocket Ross. Uh, today I'm back for a quick tutorial and as you've just seen in those first two clips which Agony did, it's basically how to change your voice to sound like deeper or like a devil or a bit demonic, something like along those lines. Now, um, it can be either used for just commentaries if you feel that your voice is a bit squeaky or for an example like that. Now, it's really easy to do, really quick. Um, what all you need to do first of all is just hop over into Sony Vegas and what I'll do first of all is I'll show you some examples of the one I've done and it can be you can feel quite embarrassing kind of shouting at your computer just for these sound clips but once you get over that it's alright so yeah have a good laugh at mine and then I'll come back get back in there and finish this it's time to kill them all what are you waiting for get in there what are you waiting for kill them Finish him. Right, so yeah, there's mine. Uh, pretty funny, just having to play about for this test video. So, what you're going to need to do first of all is right click and insert an audio track. Um, and then all you need to do is just get a clip of one that you've done. I think, what's this one here? Let's just play it. Finish him. Right, okay, finish him. Bit of Mortal Kombat style. So, all you need to do is once you've recorded your clip, if you don't know how to record, all you simply need to do is just click this record button down here, have a microphone plugged in and that'll work fine. So once you've got your audio clip, if I play it now, um, it should sound pretty gay. Finish him. Yeah, so that was me just doing that. Um, first step what you need to do is go to the, add the audio effects here, track effects, click that, and then go to the um, plugin chain up here, the first one, click that, and add a pitch shift. So highlight it, click add, click OK. So now in the audio plugins bit here, you've got pitch shift. Uh, what you first of all need to do is if you on the top bar, slide that up to three, and then what you want to do is go to where it says preserve duration, and go down to where it says A09 speech three fast. Click that, and then that's okay. With my microphone that I use, my old Turtle Beaches, I kind of get a bit of hissing, like uh, background noise, so all I do straight away is just turn this number 4 down to here, that just reduces the hiss on your microphone, if you didn't know that's a quick tip. Um, then what you want to do, is make sure this bit's highlighted here, and go to duplicate track, like so, so now you've got the one underneath. This time what you need to do is go into pitch shift, or well, the track effects, and you'll have pitch shift already here, the end one you might have to use the arrows to go across, pitch shift, now this time, this is preference, um, let's just drag it to minus six something like that you can play around that number and change the speech fast to drums tiny echo like that and then choose the arrows to go back across to where it says the track equalizer and I just turn this number one to about there like that that's just to kind of give the bass on the sound um, then what you do is you can either mute or delete the top layer it doesn't matter probably delete it when you're doing your final project so you've only got the bottom one playing now the duplicated layer so now when you press play, it sounds like that, which as you saw in Agony's two clips can look really nice, um, as I just heard from my test ones, few different ones what you can say, you could say triple, headshot, whatever, you choose, so yeah, quick audio tutorial, um, hope you guys like this, if you did, it'd be really nice if you dropped a thumbs up, it really helps, check out my other videos on my channel if you're a new subscriber, and if you're not, just click subscribe anyway, and uh, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Much love. Thanks for watching as always. Cheers, guys.